Good evening, everyone. How are you all doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up? Hello, Venom. How are you doing tonight? Hello, Clutch. Hope everyone's having a good... What day is it? It's a day. It is Wednesday, right? Wednesday. Wednesday. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. I hope that your Wednesdays are going well, that you're killing it, that you're having a good day. Um, and yeah, we're going to play some Dragon Warrior 7, I guess. That's what we do around here, right? Play video games. Heck yeah. Uh, Venom says, I don't have time to update you yet. First, I need to know about Saga Frontier Volume 2. Okay, let's, uh, let's do that. Let me just get over here to the, um, to the start screen and then we will, uh, do the Saga Frontier 2, um, Pando Party Lecture. Yeah, yeehaw. Yahoo. Doodle doodle doos. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, 2714. Yep, looks good to me. Okay, let's pause this. And we'll go like this. So we have no sound. We'll flip back to this. I'll put on some sweet glasses. Boop, 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 boop. Ding! <laughs> God, glasses get dirty fast, hey? How do all you actual glasses wearing folk deal with it? Ugh. Uh, okay, let's see. We've got Saga Frontier 2 on the docket, so let's look it up. We suffer always? Oh no, I'm so sorry to hear that. Okay, oh, I'll keep bumping into this. Okay, Saga Frontier 2. Do, 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 ASA, Saga Frontier 2, 251. Page 251, Captain Giraffe, you just ignore it? <laughs> and hey, Captain Giraffe, how you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up? Uh, okay. <coughs> Saga Frontier 2. Boop, 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 boop. There you go. Here's what it looks like. Saga Frontier 2. Please ignore the poor ripped book. Beep, 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 beep. Okay. A retro radio. Hi, Pando. Good evening. Oh, wow. This book looks awesome. It is awesome. I accidentally dropped it uh, on the ground one day um, and it broke. I have to go get it rebound at a. Uh, rebinder. Um, also, for those who don't know, I don't actually wear glasses. This is my Professor Pando uh, glasses. And yeah, we're going to read a little excerpt from the um, fr about Saga Frontier 2 as per Venom's request. Um, yeah, so uh, and thanks for rejoining us, Retro Ridia. I really appreciate that. Uh, okay, so let's learn about Saga Frontier 2. Developer? Square. You've heard of them, right? Released in 1999. Um, a PhD in JRPG is very cool. I don't actually. I hope everyone gets that's just a joke. But, <laughs> but I am quite knowledgeable. I do say so myself. Released in 1999 for the PlayStation 1. Okay. The previous two Saga trilogies took place in separate worlds, each series largely keeping the same general setting and tone. Saga Frontier 2, on the other hand, could not be any more different from its immediate predecessor. The sci-fi fantasy mashup is out the window in favor of a medieval drama, and the visual style is a breathtaking array of watercolor backdrops similar to those in Legend of Mana. Longtime Saga series composer Kenji Ito saw, sat this one out in favor of Masashi, uh, Masa, Masashi Hamuzu, Hamauzu, a new musician at Square at the time who'd go on to compose for the Final Fantasy XIII trilogy. 
set in the world of Sandile, the player appears to be a historian poring over the records of the past century. To begin with, this consists of a few scant points on a timeline which open scenarios. When these scenarios are completed, further points are unlocked on this map. There are only two protagonists this time, Gustav the 13th, the newborn heir to the King of Finney, and Will Knights, a 15-year-old scavenger of ruins. Gustave's scenario is one of political intrigue. In the world of Sandile, a person's worth is judged by their anima, their innate magical ability. However, to, as a child, Gustave is revealed to be unable to use anima, causing the king to call for his own son's execution. Yikesy, yikesy. Gustave's mother, Queen Sophie, pleads for their child to be spared, and the two are exiled from the castle. Gustave's out. Oh. <clears throat> Gustav's scenario follows his youth before, as an adult, he stakes his claim on his heritage. On the other hand, Will is a commoner living with his aunt and uncle after being orphaned, who sets off on his first expedition hoping to find forgotten artifacts called quells. Hmm. Soon he learns of the existence of a powerful quell called the Egg, which is somehow linked to his parents' demise. Oh my... Will spends his life unraveling the mystery of the egg, passing the torch on to his children and, in due course, his grandchildren. The story of the egg eventually intersects with Gustav's, leading to a grand conclusion involving the entire history of Sendile. Compared to Saga Frontier and Romancing Saga, Saga Frontier 2 is fairly linear. While optional quests exist, they're kept to a minimum in favor of mandatory scenarios that can occasionally be tackled out of order. Combat has been tweaked so you can restore HP at the cost of LP, plus you can escape from battle after a few turns. Occasionally, you're given the option to duel an opponent. This changes the battle system quite dramatically. The player is given the choice of several offensive and support abilities which, if executed in a specific order, can be combined to perform special attacks. These can be challenging, but quite rewarding, though those who don't wish to engage can usually eschew duels in favor of fighting a few extra foes as a party. Asta Saga... Uh, Asta. Asta Saga. After Saga Frontier 2, Saga only became even more experimental. Sadly, entries would also become a lot more infrequent, which makes each one all the more special. Compared to the previous Saga games, there are many changes that this one doesn't really feel like it belongs to the series, but at the same time, it's still so out there that it couldn't possibly fit anywhere else. Do -do -do -do. There you go. You've learned all about Saga Frontier 2 tonight, folks. It doesn't sound that bad, Venom. You think it's real? Oh, Venom. Venom pre-RESD take. Saga Frontier real bad. Frontier 2 real bad. Breathtaking kills. How can anything look this bad? It is? Well, it sounds like they like it well enough. They said that the the art looks great. Uh, Retro Ridia. The only Saga game I played was Minstrel Song on PlayStation 2. I really liked it. You know, I've actually also uh, have never played a Saga game. Despite the fact that I've had many opportunities to do so. It just hasn't worked out for me, you know? But we're going to do it on stream one day here because we're going to play through every JRPG ever. <laughs> Venom, they, they wrote that entry at the end of a Friday and they all had hot dates waiting for them. <laughs> maybe, maybe you're right. Um, okay, so the last time we left our heroes here in this video game, we um, were finding that um, we... We went to this temple to go get our classes changed, and turns out the temple to change your classes has been taken over by monsters. Um, and we were thrown to the bottom of this little underground prison camp town. And so that's what we're currently trying to uh, get out of. Oh dear, do you know about soul shattering? Uh, no. If you destroy five souls with the soul sword, you will be freed. But what happens to those whose souls are taken? Sounds like a bad time. Sufu may be cruel, but he won't stand for murder. If you kill someone, you'll be fodder for the monsters by nighttime. Mm, nope, nothing in the well. Mm hmm. 
<laughs> Hello, ma'am. Welcome to World Bank, the bank you love to trust. You currently have no gold stored with us. Uh, yeah, no, I'm good. Thank you. Hi, Boo List Pit. How are you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? Hey, you don't open that. Our customer's gold is in that chest. Leave it alone. What about this one? Hmm. Okay, just, just checking. Mm -hmm. Anything secret hidden over here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, in the backs of the rooms? But that's exactly why I want that chest, right, Tuffymon? I want all the money, please. Like, gosh, don't you get it, lady? I'm doing really good. Thank you for asking, Bootless Pit. Hey, I've only got 30 gold left. I can't make room with that. Guess I'll be camping out for a while. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, sir. No, all of my precious abilities are gone. All the work and all the endless hours of training have yielded nothing. Ooh, 20 gold. Well, that guy could just start breaking pots. He'll find stuff, I'm sure. I mean, I'm finding stuff. You'd best be careful at night, youngster. You never know who's going around hunting for souls. That's the only way to escape from this cesspool. There was no special books. Rude. Retro Ridia, one thing I really appreciate about this game is the music. The song for this song, for example, really sets the mood for times you travel to the past to bad things always happening. Yes, I wholeheartedly agree with you, my friend. I think um, the music in these games is incredible. You are truly a master thief, Flower. Thank you. Well, guard, I've kept my promise. It's your turn now. Yes, I think I understand. Good, I've always dreamed of joining the guards of Dharma. You're right, Jake. I've heard that once or twice before. <laughs> How are you doing, Jake? What's going on? Well, in that case, I'll need one more thing from you. Jake, sorry, wasn't sure if anyone has told you that yet. You know, you know what? I haven't heard that yet. <laughs> Richard, 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 it's quite an undertaking, totally. When I started streaming it, uh, I had like at least three people come into stream a uh, day being like, hey, this game is really long. And I'm like, oh, I know. <laughs> what? Do you have any idea how hard it was to get that medicine? Come on, don't get angry. You want to be a guard, no? Right, see you later. Uh, bye. Oh good, more dung. More dung for the dung pile. The chest was empty, of course it was. You're new here, aren't you? Well, I'm the man you're looking for, Flower. My specialty is theft, but I do just about everything. There's nothing I can't get my hands on. It'll cost you, though. <laughs> Yay, dung. A Dragon Quest classic, right? Tuppymon immediately finds a herb. Well, guard, I don't think finding medicine was that hard, right? <laughs> Okay, what do we got hiding behind the doors, the walls here? Nothing. I'm a priest of Dharma Temple. No, really, I am. I barely escaped with my life. You must believe me. Hello, Mr. Johnny Ringo. Hello, Kisnato. How are you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? That man at the bank is a few leaves short of a medicinal herb. Everyone knows all the priests were killed. They say Nara spends more time asleep than awake. But every time she gets sick, Zaji's always there for her. Soul shatters are rarely successful here due to the soul sword. When someone is hit with it, he lets out a piercing scream and everyone rushes to the attacker. 
It's all very dark and gloomy, huh? The monsters around here leave us alone for the most part. Really, more people are killed in brawls than by monsters. You don't need these bottles, right? Ooh, yes, a tiny metal. Perfect. Story of the day. Had to miss half my day at work because a tooth broke. Oh my goodness. How did you break a tooth, Kisanato? Holy guacamole. That doesn't sound fun or comfortable. You're okay now? That's good. But what the heck did you do? Uh-oh. All right, people, who dares to take the challenge? Who dares to stake their fit future on the soul sword? Just less money in the bank, yeah. Tooth stuff, never cheap. Sure, just come into my ca tavern and throw stuff, right? Soul sword, what's that? It's easy, just take the soul sword and shatter five souls. Best Bender, oh man, are you excited to finally have a job? You bet I am. I'm sick of being a classless jerk. <laughs> By eating? Oh no, Kisnado. <laughs> your lost powers will be restored and your freedom regained. Oh, really? Of course, Lord Antulia is just a, ru a just ruler. Any human with the courage to take up the challenge is eligible. Well, <laughs> I don't mean to laugh at you, Kesonado, but I thought it would be something really intense, but I'm just picturing you, like, trying to eat rocks now or something. Best Bender. Also, I'm sad I missed Kiefer leaving. I still need to watch that VOD. Yeah, that happened last night. If anyone here is brave enough, let him step forward now. Get out! We don't want to hear anything you have to say. Ah, well, don't forget this, humans. Only soul shattering will get you out of this prison. Damn monsters coming here on broad daylight. Oh, you must be the new people I've heard about. I've been meaning to pummel you for a while. What a convenient opportunity. Okay, well, they're gonna get got, so... Or I'm gonna get got. I don't... I don't like when I don't know if a fight's a loser, like a fight I have to lose or not, you know? Hi, Deco Michi. How you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? Your tidy just got home from work. Was it a long day? Oh my gosh, a brutal hit. That's so rude. You hear that? You're quite tired as well. Oh no, I hope you have some coffee or that you get to go to bed at a good time tonight. Nikomichi, not long, but I was working on order, so I was constantly moving. Did it make the day go by fast at least? Flip. It was pan. It was pan that had the. Man, what bad luck that we had the stupid. Uh, that he hit me with a mega attack right there.
Okay, that's just on me. Okay, we're just gonna rush this. If I die, I die. It's okay. You think this is an impossible to win fight? Okay. Good evening, Best Bender. How you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? Okay. Good. I'm glad I didn't end up wasting any herbs or anything then. <laughs> and I hope you're doing well, Space Robot Arm. So great to see ya. You're just too nice for your own good, Neris. Clark, thank you so much for following. People like that don't deserve the time of day. If I'd left them there, they would have been robbed blind. Who cares? They're strangers, Neris. So nice that they rescued me, but if I just break your pots and take whatever's in them. Pam picked up a book entitled Useful Plants. It is about the medicinal qualities of herbs and berries. The doing great, the saga of the floor continues. Well, I'm very, very proud of you for that. How much longer is that going to take you? Like a few weeks? Or is it hopefully going to be done today? Is it just the one room? Or Oh, you're all feeling better? You must be very strong. You were sleeping like the dead until now. I doubt that I'd be able to recover so quickly. My sister should be in bed, not looking after you guys. Send Zaji! I don't know why I said Zenji. Are you home, Neris? I brought you some medicine. Look, it's World Dew. I know this will make you feel better. Oh, look, it's World Dew. I know this will make you feel better. Oh, the squid hat? Perfect. Ruler of Inches. Hey, Pando, I feel like your stream layout changes every game you play. Um, it stays... R we change the, the logo and stuff. Like, right now it says Pando Quest. Um, but it stays mostly the same. How you doing, Ruler of Inches? What's going on? What's on the up and up? There we go. Got the squid. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oops, like this. There we go. But I, yeah, we try to change it up moderately often. There we go. Cool. Killing it. Gosh, the squid hat does not work with bangs. Let me tell you what. <laughs> oh my gosh, bangs. What are you doing? Please just choose this direction to go right now. We'll fix those later. Oh, thank you. But how did you get such expensive? Ah, here, I'll give it to you. Let me go. I can take it by myself. What? Oh, sorry. Here, let's go to the other room. Thank you for the medicine, Kasim. Oh, you want to hear the murloc too? Are you a squid or a kid? Definitely a squid. Oops. Woohoohoo! Thank you. You've been a wonderful audience. Mwah. <laughs> hey, Brig. What's going on? What's on the up and up? Uh, Mr. Johnny Ringo, useful plan tip number 56. Place whatever in your friend's laundry for a good laugh. Trust me, I'm a botanist. Space robot arm. This room might be done tonight, depending on how much energy I have. Uh, then I have a hallway, two more bedrooms, and the dreaded staircase. I will be at this for a while. Oh, okay. So this is like a full house thingy going on. Thank you for the medicine, Kasim. Neris needs to get some rest as soon as possible. Ruler of Inches. Speaking of Hearthstone, have you played Inscription? Were we speaking of Hearthstone? <laughs> um, but no, I've been meaning to play Inscription. I really, really, really want to play Inscription. What? I'm just worried about Neris. That's all. Okay, Neris. This should be you. This should get you back on your feet again. Hmm. My face is red. That's strange. I wonder if I have a fever. I'm gonna lie down in my room for a little while. I 
I think Kasim is fond of my sister. That's why he's so considerate. Of course, he has no regard for me. Um, it's a squid, Mr. Johnny Ringo. Someone requested it. Um, Ruler of Inches. I know Murlocs from Hearthstone. I highly recommend inscription. You would love it. Oh, that's you. Okay, yes. Murlocs are definitely come from Hearthstone. Um, but they actually come from World of Warcraft. Or Warcraft in general. It's basically the full upstairs except for the game room studio. That's my last bastion of carpet. Oh, I see. I see. Do you, do you like carpet and you don't want the other stuff or... I've been sick ever since I was born. My brother goes through so much to get medicine for me. Oh, Saji, I'm sure I'm such a burden on him. Okay, well, it's a uh, Vamoodle. I've I might have heard Brig that this game is incredibly long. Mr. Johnny Ringo, ooh, dissecting squid was fun. Love marine biology. I've never dissected any creatures, but. Space Robot Arm. I prefer carpet, but Mrs. Robot Arm disagrees. I think I agree with Mrs. Robot Arm, to be honest. <laughs> you swear you'll make me a temple guard this time? Without High Priest Foss, there are no temple guards. That's why I want you to rescue her from the monsters. Sure, just promise me, alright? But I can't imagine why you'd want to be a temple guard now. Well, you have to play the hand you're dealt. It's not like I could become a temple guard any other way. Brig, you're already the second. Uh, Jake also made sure we had that message today. <laughs> I know how great a thief you are, so don't let me down. You just fought with Sifu, right? You didn't do too bad. Listen, I've got a favor to ask of you. The only way out of this town is through the Western Cave. I need someone to help battle the monsters there. I'll make it worth your while. Here, look. Flower handed a small stone to Maribel. Maribel obtained the Wonder Rock. There's one, that's one useful stone. You can heal yourself all you want with it. So it's a deal, right? Good. Carpet is so cozy though. Like, I agree with you on one way. On the other way, like, carpet gets really dirty. It's, like, really... I, I like how easy it is to clean uh, hardwood or, um, or like, lin uh, laminate. Um, you know, the fake hardwood. Uh, but that being said, like, real hardwood. Now, that's, that's the ultimate coziness to me. With, like, a good rug. Flower joined the party. Okay, we got a new little party buddy. Oops. No, I didn't want to do this yet. I wanted to see if I missed anything around here. Oh, but I didn't realize we could leave here. So that being said, it means we can go grind out the money for Maribel's wand thingy. Which is what we're going to do. We're also going to save the game, though. Yes, we're going to prison break, all right. I mean, it's not necessarily a prison. We just got thrown into, like, a, a town with no with no way out, really. Except to go through a cave full of creatures that will kill you. Hey, Torpedo! Pokemon! Thank you so much for the Prime sub. That means so much to me. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Captain Giraffe, my entire house is laminate. I wasn't sure of it, but I got used to it. Yeah, I don't know. I think that's just nice for like sweeping and cleaning real nice and easy. Um, also, also, we're gonna go run around in circles now. Where we've come to the part of the game now where we have to run in circles for a little while. So I hope you can forgive me.
Dr. Chorus, welcome back from the convention. Thanks, Dr. Chorus. How are you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? Slime Knight is probably your favorite Dragon Quest enemy of all time. Pork Bungai, I want this game so bad. It's uh, it's real good. Uh, I wonder. I think I wonder if the 3DS version is also really expensive now. Um, it is kind of hard to get your hands on, but it's flipping great. Uh, Space Robot Arm. Another news. I've come to the end of my Final Fantasy VII playthrough. I tried to beat it earlier today, but Sefi killed me. <gasps> Did he? That's so rude of him. Okay, we need 4,000 gold. We're at 1,700. Dr. Chorus, doing good. Just finished reading a book. I'm going to pick up my Black Forest cake here shortly. What? What's the occasion for the cake? Or do you just want a, a sweet Black Forest cake? Uh, Best Bender, who wouldn't want to fight while riding a slime? I mean, you're right. I mean, look at these guys. Those slimes are having a gosh darn golly good time. And I can't blame them. And thank you so much for following Pork Bun Guy. Uh, Dace. Hi, Pando. Hi, chat. Love the hat. Thanks. Thank you so much, Dace. How you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? Mr. Johnny Ringo. I wonder if that slime, if that slime tastes like lime jello. Don't even think about eating slime. Slimes, I mean, despite the fact that slimes want us dead, they're also my friends. Dr. Chorus. I have Dragon Quest 7 on DS and PlayStation. Uh, and I definitely think the PlayStation version is better in, a, in service of the story. Lurking for a bit. I'll be back in a bit. Yes, I also own it in both places. And I think the PS1 version is better only because my cart is bugged on the 3DS and I actually can't proceed further than an hour into the game. Oh, that's disturbing, Mr. Johnny Ringo. <laughs> So just, just a heads up for anyone who's wondering what I'm doing. Uh, there's a weapon at the shop here that is 4,000 gold. And I need it in order to... For Maribel. And I don't like to move on until I have all the latest stuff. So that's what we doing. Fish are friends, not food. Exactly. Oh. It's been 10 minutes, so... Go back to my normal hair. It's in a ponytail today, so it probably just looks like I have not much hair. Oh, I think it's going to be bang trim time soon. <laughs> Exciting. <laughs> Actually, you know, bef before we continue this little whatever we're doing here. I'm just going to doubly doubly check my um... Okay, so yes, it's just the everything else is great. We just need this sleep thingy for Maribel and Lady. I think I have everything here from the armor store. Yes. Okay, lower lower good lower oh I don't have this tray shield I probably should buy this for Maribel did I not buy this for Maribel okay there we go now I fixed that so let's sell whatever she was holding on to before. Oh, we can get rid of some of these other things too. We have this horned hat. And uh, the kitten shield. 
I'm guessing it casts sleep if you use it as an item. It, it might, it might just actually cast sleep when we attack with it too. But, oh, I have way more stuff to sell I forgot about. So it should make the grind a little more bearable. Do, 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 do. Okay, I think that's everything. Yes, okay. Well, yes, the grind will be much shorter now. So we just need, I think it's 41. 42, 42, 42, okay. It's just, just about a thousand gold we need to earn, which is not so hard. Easy peasy lemon squeeze, squeeze, squeezy, squeezy. <laughs> Aha, uh -huh. I love the Drac, Drac slimes. They're so cute. Can you hear that very loud car go by? I've been a motorbike. I don't know. Couldn't really tell, but it's the time of year now where it's too cold for the AC to be on in my building. But it means that it's still warm enough where I need to open the windows. Oh, good. That's good. But there was a very loud vehicle that just went by, rumbling and grumbling. And, and I'm like, is that really necessary? Vehicle? Nice. <laughs> Jake, but you were just saying a few streams ago how much you like loud, obnoxious cars. I think you might have dreamed that, Jake. <laughs> We were talking about loud, obnoxious cars. I was talking about how much I dislike them. Rude. Man, you could easily use Kiefer right about now. Yeah, I mean, he was such a heavy hitter. It was really nice, kind of a tank. Um, but we'll be fine. It's nice because Flower heals us, so you can't complain about that.
item. Okay, almost there. Almost a 4200. Getting closer all the time. Getting closer all the time. So there's no stream tomorrow because Thursday is my night off. Uh, but Friday we return with our premiere of Elden Ring or Panden Ring as we're calling it. I hope that sounds fun to you all. Man, I love boomerangs. Ruler Vengeance, I'm flipping hype for Elden Ring. The loathsome Nugs Eater. <laughs> Mr. Johnny Ringo, looking forward to the Elden Ring stream. Super happy fun times. Retro Ridia, Elden Ring is great. Nice. I haven't ever touched well i played a little bit of demon souls back on the ps3 back on its atlas days um but i haven't really ever played much more of them so uh best bender i just checked a wiki and apparently the sleep staff does cast sleep if used as an item could be really useful since maribel lost her ability to use magic nice oh good job gabo for joining us at level 17 Space Robot Arm says, I'll be honest. I hit a wall in Elden Ring and I've pretty much given up. It was like at like the 75 hour mark though. Totally fair. I don't know if we'll like 100% finish Elden Ring or whatever, but we're gonna definitely give it a good goo for a while. Why does the third Drax slime not have pupils in his eyes? I noticed that too, Best Bender, and I keep, there's like always a little bit of a difference. So if you look, the, the Drax slime on the left ha doesn't have a pupil. And then if you look at the, the uh, slime knight on the very far right, he's kind of looking in another direction, you know? He's not looking straight forward, so they kind of like mess with them just a little bit. And Jake Elden Ring. <laughs> Ruler of Inches, the character creator is great. You can make some bad looking dudes and ladies. Are you telling me there's a character creator? Cause let me tell you what, we're gonna be in that character creator for a while. This is so weird. I think it might've been like made on purpose this way. Okay, almost there. 41, 39. We'll earn just a little extra too so we could stay at the, um, the inn. You always make your character look like Winona Ryder. Interesting. Jake, five streams in and Panda will still be creating her character. Uh, it was a very real possibility. <laughs> we're going to really make her rad as flippin' heck. That's what we're going to do. Different colored eyes and all that. Ooh. 
I love the character creator. Neo 2 is the best character creator you've ever played. Interesting. I've always been curious to play the Neo games, but I've never... I've never have. Whoa. Enemies. You are not allowed to heal. Only me. The Pando is allowed to heal. Okay. Got it. Bubs. Woohoo! Okay, this should be enough for the inn and for the new item. I guess we're gonna sell whatever the leather whip that um, girly has here too, so. This can pack quite a punch in battle. Who will take it? It will be Maribel, thank you. No, but I will sell you the leather whip. No, but I'm going to use the inn wherever it may be. Yes, I thought it was down here. Okay, now we'll save the game and then we'll continue on with the story. This town's called Penal because it's like a jail. Get it? <laughs> Cancel Pando. Kind of want to buy items from that guy, but whatever. I think we'll be fine. Prison break time, right? Time to get the heck out of here. Ooh, look at these guys. These are new. These are uh, more armor peons. Are you gonna see a movie tomorrow? I might just go see a movie tomorrow. I might go to the the independent theater and see like a an anime film that's playing there. It's like the it's like the art theater, the art arty house, house theater. Nekomichi says, Mom scene, don't worry, darling, tonight. I've heard uh, not very good things about it, so I don't know if I'll see that movie. Okay, there's a staircase up. Best Bender, have you ever seen Forrest Gump? It's probably my favorite movie. Of course I've seen... I, I think it's hard to be from the 90s and have not seen Forrest Gump, you know? <laughs> seen it multiple times. It's very, very good. But most of all, it's a fantastic soundtrack. It's a pre-release showing. I don't think it comes out to the 23rd for, uh, for full release. Nekomichi, you know, as I was saying that, I'm like, Nekomichi's gonna tell me she hasn't seen Forrest Gump. And that's fine. I think it's to be expected from you at this point. 
you're not really a movie person, so. <laughs> Okay, so this is just a dead end. Good. Glad we checked that out. No, I mean, like, movie people are people who kind of watch basically anything, so... That's what I mean by movie people, you know? The Best Bender, what about the Truman Show? I watched it in middle school and it freaked me out, but then later saw it as an adult and realized how awesome it is. Oh, of course I've seen the Truman Show. I loved that movie uh, when I was um, a youth. But it's fantastic. What are my favorite movies? Um, so my favorite movies are um, Amelie, which is um, <clears throat> a French film from the, uh, I mean, it was not, it's very mainstream. It won the Oscar for best international film that year. A really huge, yeah. <laughs> Jake knows what my favorite movies are. Uh, so Amelie is one of them. Spirited Away is another. Jurassic Park, definitely another. Uh, those are, yes, those are definitely in my top faves right there. Um, oh, what's over here? Gamer Jam. Stuart Little was good as well. Your favorite movie is Baby, Baby Driver. Interesting. Baby Driver is pretty darn good. I haven't seen Stuart Little since I was quite little, so I don't really remember what it's like. There's been a few movies I've seen this year. Well, there's been a couple movies this year that might be contenders for my favorite movies of all time list. Uh, but we'll see how, what kind of longevity they have in my brains after all. But um, I saw everything everywhere all at once this year and I just died. I thought it was flipping fantastic. And then um, Marcel the Shell with Shoes On, that movie, I cannot over... I cannot underline how much that movie meant to me. Like, I sometimes think about it and want to start crying. Um, so I also really, uh, really can't wait to watch it again now that it comes out on, when it comes out to streaming. I've been dying for it to come out on streaming so I could rewatch uh, Marcel, the shell with shoes on. It's really incredible. It's just really, really top-notch quality stuff. Another movie you really enjoyed but gave you bad anxiety was The Martian. Interesting. I saw The Martian and thought it was quite good. But yes, I can see how it would give you anxiety. You think you love disaster movies, but they're really bad for you. That's fair. <laughs> Well, this is bad, 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 bad. Ooh, okay. Angelata, hiya, Pando. Happy Wednesday. Hope you're having a very rad news rhinos kind of day. You bet your bottom dollar I am. How are you doing, Angelata? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? Okay, guys, there are two monsters guarding the exit up ahead. If we try to attack them head on, there's no way we'll win. You sit tight while I take care of this one. Hmm? What was that noise? That was you, was it? 
With this power given to me by Antoria, I will treat you all to a bath of blood. Hey, there's another one over there. Ah, let him go. We've got enough prey in our hands now. You're right, you're right. <laughs> oh my gosh, the guy used me. Uh, enchilada nearing the weekend, which is good, had a busy day because we had community day. So many volunteered for things like planting trees and going to senior centers for the day. So kind of crazy to deal with that stuff today. I bet that sounds nuts, but also really good. Ruler of Inches. I watched Austin Powers last night on Netflix and was dying laughing. Forgot how great it was. Yeah, Austin Powers was pretty fun, if not really stupid. <laughs> Best Bender. After seeing Titanic, I couldn't think about anything else for days. The CGI of the ship sinking was a bit much for you, but it was still great. Interesting. I uh, I saw Titanic back in 1997 in the theater, and I quickly decided I didn't want to hear about it ever again. Oh my gosh. What? Is this a I gotta lose fight? Cause holy. <laughs> Gabo can do it. <laughs> Go Gabo! Go Gabo! <laughs> okay, that's what I thought. I thought we were gonna have to die. That's one derpy tiger. Jake, I've avoided Titanic for 25 years. I think... I think you should see it. I don't think it's super great, but I think it's worth seeing in order to just understand it. I mean, understand like, I don't know, all of it, I guess. You know, it, it changed a lot of things for movies. <laughs> oh, you're already out of bed? The priest said you all collapsed in front of town, severely injured. I brought you here to rest until you feel better. It's already late, so please feel free to spend the night here. Well, spoiler, Jake, the ship sinks. <laughs> Dang it, Captain Giraffe. <laughs> Neris, can I talk to you outside for a minute? What difference does it make? We can talk here. No, not with all these people around. <sighs> hey, Tadoku, how you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? I'm sorry, but I have to go out for a bit. Could you watch the house? Yes, I'll watch the house. I didn't realize it was where the draw me like your French girls meme was from since I didn't see it until way later. <laughs> Listen, I'm perfectly capable of getting the medicine you need. There's no need for you to be making eyes at that man. What? What did I ever do that? You've got the wrong idea, Zaji. Kasim is a nice man, but that's all. He's being nice to you because he wants to take you away, Neris. What? Don't you dare say things like that about him, Zaji. Why, Neris? Why are you defending that jerk? Haven't we managed just fine until now, just the two of us? Saji! You're doing okay overall? Well, that's good to hear, Dodoku. I have a feeling it's not good that these kids went out at night by themselves. I've got a bad feeling about tonight. I can't really explain it, but I think it's best to turn in early on such a night. Turn in early on such a night. You're probably not wrong. I'm afraid of that fighter hanging around the tool shop. I'm above all this. I'm special. I don't need this. No one will think any worse of me for it. They'll probably respect me. Neris just went running down the alley, chasing her brother. You think she's okay? She looked like she was in pain. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Don't st 
startle me like that. You made me throw up everything I ate. Oh, God. I think he's barfing on his own just fine. I'm sorry, but could you please go after my brother? I'm too tired out to chase him any longer. The mansion Suifu lives in used to be mine. He took over after he defeated me. It's much safer at night in groups than by yourself. It's easy to shatter the soul of someone who travels alone. Oh great, I'm gonna run out of wood soon. All I've got left is my underwear. Should I throw them in? Yes. Are you joking? I can't go around naked. <laughs> well, I'll try it. I thought it'd be funny. Didoku, I was just on a cruise boat t five times the size of the Titanic, which is nuts to think about, right? Look, don't bother my sister, all right? She's a sick girl. I'm not hurting anyone. Neris is everything to me. Besides, what do you care? She can do whatever she wants. Shut up. What's wrong with me looking after my sister? All right. What will you do for me if I give up on Neris? What? Why should I have to do anything for you? Sorry, kid. I'm not about to stop seeing her for nothing. Damn it. You never take me seriously, Kasim. Just remember this, Kasim. I'm perfectly capable of caring for Neris myself. I don't need you. <laughs> Sorry you had to see that. I don't know why that kid gets me so worked up. Damn that Kasim. What did Sachi say to Kasim? I'll have to scold him later. Jake, I want a research of resurgence of airships as a form of travel. Ha! I did it! But he's not dead. I merely shattered his soul. Your soul has not been wasted. The world will forever praise you. Now I need four more. Sweet God! That man is insane! What the hell are you waiting for? Get him! Now! Uh, why did you have to come out now? Oh, the humanity, Shinobi. <laughs> Although he's still breathing, he doesn't respond to you. <gasps> yeah! He's lying on the ground, groaning and muttering. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh. Uh. Gra! That guy's stronger than he looks. Son of a! I'll just have to take care of him myself. Hey, Kasim! If you help me out, I'll give you whatever you want. Okay, okay. Now then, it's time for you to die, great warrior. Just when I was almost done. Damn it, I just can't stand it. I've come too far to die. Neris! Are you alright? Saji! I did it! The fifth soul! Come on out, monsters! I fulfilled my promise! Give me back my powers! Well done, human. Your courage is unquestionable. But the fifth soul has not yet been shattered. What? But I cut it with the soul sword! The soul sword must go deep into the body to shatter the soul. Your stab was too light on the fifth victim, human. No, I can't be killed here. You will not die. Skill never goes unrewarded. Let me return your stolen power. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Now for the five soulless bodies. Uh, 
Try to calm down, okay? You'll worry yourself sick. I can't calm down. Sachi's gone. Well then, shall we go help your brother? B b how? Well, that depends on all. Well, that depends on everyone here. The Western Cave is dangerous, but if we go together, we can make it. Please, everyone, help me. I need to save Saji. Oh, thank you. All right, Neris and I will go on ahead to the Western Cave. Monsters are guarding the exit on the fourth floor. We'll meet there. Hey, did you hear? Someone managed to shatter five souls. I did hear. I'm not sure why, but those whose souls are shattered are taken away by the monsters. I wonder what horrors they are made to endure. Let's go save the game. Okay, let's go. The scoundrel who tried to rob me had his soul ripped from his body. My prayers have been answered. There really is a god. This town is full of people manipulated and fooled by the high priest. Alright, that's normal stuff. Uh, okay, let's head on out then. I want to make a Dark Souls joke about the situation, but I don't know what it would be. <laughs> okay, um, I'm just gonna actually, I think I have some of these Pan just gets all of the good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I think I have to use it only in battle. Hmm. I have more of these things in here. Yes, I do. Pan is doing drugs. Pan's doing all the drugs. Pan can't stop doing drugs. Uh, okay, we're doing all right. Moving on. Man, Tippians are kind of fun looking. I like their big old eyeballs. Um, I haven't necessarily looked recently, Space Robot Arm. I need, I need to get in there and start searching. It's just been a busy few weeks, so... <laughs> okay, I went that way the last time. And... I just want to see if there's a treasure chest or something I missed over yonder. Oh, it says we're, yes, we came in here. Okay, so that was just a dead end for that way. 
I feel like we are obligated to remind you to get a VCR every single stream. Please do. I need to be reminded about things all of the time. Otherwise, I will never do literally anything, so. The zombie eye is kind of a creepy little feller, isn't he? And Captain Draft, all the drugs you say? Remind me about the VCR. What's that about again? Um, I have countless amounts of, um, of VHS tapes that are very important to me that I need to get a VCR for. I have the way to plug in the VCR to my computer and digitize all of this stuff. Um, I have a lot of home movies I've made. I have all of my, like, I recorded a lot of videos as a kid, um, as a teenager, and I need to get all that all that stuff like saved for all time otherwise i'll probably die it's like my um not to make a harry potter reference but you know how voldemort put the horcruxes i mean the horcruxes and he like put his soul into them i feel like my vhs tapes are like my part of my soul and i need to preserve them otherwise things are going to go very awry for me <laughs> if they do get destroyed before i'm able to fix them or able to save them for all time. Dodoku. I'm pretty sure I still have a VCR. <laughs> yeah, I wish, like I have a VCR attached to a television, but it does not have video out and I need video out in order to do what I need to do. Um, I need, right, I need to use some herbs. Pest Bender, don't say his name. Uh, yeah, I try not to think too much about Harry Potter stuff anymore, but it was just the best analogy I could think of for that moment. Well, this is where they were. Item. Yes, I'm uploading the memories to the Matrix. Exactly. Oh, I didn't realize Pan health was so low. Not necessarily so low, but... Didn't realize it taking quite the hit. Why do you get to use heal and I don't? Rude, rude, rude. feel any better. Thanks. I'm hanging in there. Listen, I wanted to give this to you. Oh, a hair on ornament. It's beautiful. Can I try it on? Thanks for the hydrate, Captain Giraffe. Ding. What do you think? It's nice. It looks good on you. Jeez, you guys, you should have told us you were there. 
<laughs> Hope we're not intruding on anything. Well, never mind that. Did you see how the monsters are gone? I'm not quite sure what happened, but at least we don't have to fight such powerful foes. We're going on ahead. See you later. You must have come from that town at the foot of the mountains. I can tell by the way you look. There are only Dharma priests and those controlled by the monsters in this village. Be very careful of the ones controlled by the monsters. They've been horribly corrupted. We're being guarded by those who've had their souls shattered. They're humans too, so we can't bring ourselves to harm them, but they've killed those of us who've attempted to escape. Money is everything. I'll sell you whatever you need, so long as you give me money. What is this? Star Ort? Chilly here today, but me no complain. Yeah, I, I wouldn't complain about that either. It rained a bit on and off today and yesterday, but not much. It hasn't really rained or anything here. It's been kind of sunny and warm. It actually got up to like 23 today. It was all I could do to make sure the high priest was all right. I failed at rescuing her. I'm sorry. But just finding out she's alive is something at least. If we can save Fosse, the other guards that are left might come help her. You'll let me join the temple guards? I can't do that until you've done something fantastic. Hey, come on. I betrayed those nice people and everything for you. Don't get so discouraged. I'll give you your chance. But in return, you'll have to cooperate with me. Now the Cassim seems like not a good feller. According to the wiki, a star ort can be used as an item in battle to confuse enemies. Man, I really wish the game had better in-game descriptions. That'd be pretty nice, but alas, alack. There are guards in Dharma who are supposed to protect the High Priest, but most died in the battle. If only we had the strength to fight, we could rescue High Priest Fossey. High Priest Fossey is the only true leader of Dharma Temple. It's an outrage that the High Priest was captured by invading monsters and imprisoned deep in the cave. An outrage. Okay, looks like that's it for here. Last I looked at my weather app, apparently it's supposed to just pour here for the next five days. But I mean, if you guys haven't gotten too much, then I probably won't get too much, if any. Right? The Dharma priests are nothing but a bunch of miserable cowards. Their leader is captured and not a one of them makes a move to go rescue her. I can't stand looking at those cowardly priests shaking and trembling with fear. What do you want? Leave me alone. Ah, it's you! Don't tell me you're here for revenge. Well, that's a big relief. Water under the bridge, right? Friends? What exactly is your job? Can you tell me that? To protect the chief priest, Fossey. That's right. The other soldiers defended the high priest with their lives. Not only did you fail in defending her, you botched the rescue attempt too. Aren't you ashamed? I have no excuse for myself, but if you'll give me one more chance, I'll try to redeem myself. 
With the help of these soldiers gathered here, I vowed to rescue the High Priest. Huh. Thieves and travelers. Perfect followers for the likes of you, I'd say. I have my misgivings, but I guess I'll leave it to you. I'm sorry to get all of you involved in this, but I just can't get along without your strength. Even if you're somewhat reluctant, I must have your cooperation now. I heard there was a lot of people here who've had their souls shattered, but I can't find my brother Zaji anywhere. Why is Zaji the only one who isn't here? Pan picked up the head priest's journal and read it. Another priest died today from starvation. It's hell to watch my friends die all around me. I'd almost rather... Dot, dot, dot. No, not this horrible stain on my career as head priest. This is the first successful invasion in the history of Dharma Temple. Curse those monsters. Okie doke. Bye. That loudmouth old man infuriates me. Just saying whatever he wants like that. That's what's hard about this job. When you're a temple guard, you have to put up with people like that. I'll do my best. There's an old legend that says monsters gain power from negative human emotions like grief, anger, and sadness. Are we only being allowed to live in order to provide the monsters with energy? Wouldn't put it past him, you know? Haven't seen you around before. Usually no one but those damn priests here. I'm not even going to bother with you. I only care about tormenting those priests. Well lure appeared from the well. Oh no. A creature in the well. Look at him. He looks kind of spooky. Ouch. Oh, well, never mind. Woohoo! Level ups. Oh, good job, Maribel. Shh, don't talk to me. This is an important hand. I'm playing too, so I shouldn't talk, but there's no need to get uptight about a game of cards. Wahoo! Tiny metal. Nothing useful, dang it. Well, tiny metals are always good to find. I met a priest who fell ill after exploring the cave. Before before dying, he told me that it splits in two. One way leads to Dharma Temple, the other to the prison. Well, that's good to know. Even though my soul was shattered, I was never ill or under the control of the monsters. Was I just lucky? Does that mean my soul wasn't completely destroyed? Magic is the one thing I excel at, and now I can't use it properly. For mages and priests, this is a horrendous fate. Courageous servants of God, what do you seek in our temple? I would like to save. Wahoo! 35 books. 
It's nothing fancy, but if you're tired, you're welcome to rest here. Yes, please. Need it. There's no response. He must be sleeping. Oh. He's staring at the ceiling. He doesn't even realize he's being spoken to. All of these people had their souls shattered. They were spared from forced servitude under the monsters, but now they are bedridden. Best Bender, man, it feels you're so close to unlocking classes, but there's still a decent amount more to this place. Yep, that's what I figured. <laughs> that's okay, I'm, I'm still playing for like three hours yet, or two and a half, I guess now, but. Who would have thought that the victims of soul shattering were being used to watch over the priest? We must leave those two guards at the entrance asleep. Shouldn't you kill them? What if they woke up? No, we can't kill them. We must devise a way to rescue the high priest without waking them. You're here. Great. The high priest is confined in the prison of the cave. To get Dharma back, we must rescue the high priest. There was a little guy who just walked away. I think he was listening to us. Kasim and Flower join the party. Best Bender, they really troll you at the beginning. I felt betrayed because that I was finally getting the classes, but nope. He doesn't respond. He seems to be unconscious. Okay, good, good, good. This has got to be to the dungeons, right? Woo, so many ways down. Okay, well, we'll start with the first one. Okay. Ooh, look at these guys. Babaloon. Oh, yes, you're right. I missed that. Woohoo! Thanks, Nekomichi. The sickle. Okay, so that was there, that was there. You thought you saw a variation in the wall? Nice, I didn't really look well enough, but yeah. Okay, so there's a door for that one. This place freaking sucks. It's so easy to get lost. I bet. I mean, it does seem rather maze-like, but um, I, it, it takes a lot for me to get lost in these kinds of games. Who turns a prison into a maze? Well, why wouldn't you? <laughs> then your your people can never get lost. Direction is Pando's superpower. Heck yeah, it is. Aha. <laughs> to keep prisoners from escaping, duh, right? Thank you. 
Might be getting burgled yet. <laughs> Yeehaw! The tiny metal. Okay, so there was this one, and there was this one here that I avoided. The good thing about streaming is we will see if someone is coming up from behind you, but the bad thing is the chat delay will prevent us from warning you. <laughs> right? Aw, oh, shucks. <laughs> it's okay. My door is always locked, and I can see it at any given moment. <laughs> I always know what's up. strength seed exactly uh, end up absolutely hi ragnets how you doing tonight what's going on what's on the up and up my friend oh dear a skeleton and a skull in this one Oh, is it your birthday today, Ragnitz? Happy birthday. Woo hoo hoo. September's a busy month for birthdays. Oh, item. Let's try. I really mean. I want to keep trying this wonder rock. Did you do anything fun for your birthday today, Ragnitz? Can you try using the sleep staff as an item? I mean, I could, but I'm just going to wake up the creature right away by fighting it. <laughs> Not really, just work. But I'll try it just for you, Best Bender. an iron shield. Have you beaten Dragon Quest Pando? <laughs> Star Pendle, how are you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up? I'm pretty sure we determined we're about 25% of the way through. Regnets is also your wife's birthday. Oh, happy birthday to your wife. I already have that shield best bender, but it's great to sell it. So she went out and bought cupcakes. Your wife's doing it right. You gotta treat yourself. Can't depend on anyone else to do it. I said that weirdly bitter, but I got extremely spoiled this year, so. <laughs> if you're doing well, new job getting used to. And the kiddos saying happy birthday to us. Oh, sweet. Heck yeah. I 
I feel like I have to like drop down that hole, but maybe not. Maybe it was just for funsies to look at it. I don't know. But. Oh yeah, the Wonder Rock's awesome. You can just keep using it. <laughs> Jake, Pando38 looks 25 but has the bitterness of someone in their 80s. <laughs> I'm not actually bitter at all. I'm super happy. <laughs> I think I just sometimes like try to play into other people's like grumps and then I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> Best under these guys are so cute. I know. I love them. I love them so much. Okay, so this is a dead end. So it must be that other way. I must have to like jump down that hole or something. Nakamichi, Panda is awesome and amazing, especially in person. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Ooh, a world leaf. Good news, bears. Why, <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The other staircase is just the way back up. Right. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to use it. Oh, right, that makes sense. I know what you're saying. Hi. I love these pod guys. They're so cute. Woohoo! Tiny metals. Can't stop finding the tiny metals. There she is, the High Priest Fossey. Oh, how she must have suffered in that confined cell. Fear not, Priest. We'll get you out of there. Damn it. I can't break it down. Well, let's go break it down, team. Do I have to drop these thingies on it? 
Yes, let me, I bet you I can fall down easily, so. I'm just gonna double check. Uh, yes, we wanna break these thingies. So this one looks like the, excuse me while I mumble to myself incessantly here. Um, oh, I think I did this the wrong way. Yes, you did, yes, you did. Let's go like this, back like this, around like this. I think this is the right spot to do it, so. Oh, do you think it's the last one? No, it's gotta be the first one, right? It's all perspective here. It's gotta be this one, and then we go like this. Ah, stink bombs. Save the lady with the cat ears. Will do. Okay. So that was too early. So I think we were one square too early. So. Up and then down and then right here. I think we'll be do it. Wahoo! Okay, then this one is I think all the way at the bottom, but we'll go down and verify. Yeah, I think that's the last. Like the bottom of the like I think if we throw it or maybe it's the second. I bet you it's got a little thingy here. Let me look. Oh, yes. I bet you it's this one right here. So let's try this. Um, I can't actually. I'm pushing myself around. So, yes, I cannot drop down here myself. That would kill me. The height would be too extreme. But I think it's like this and then like this. Yeah. Me good. Me good. Thank you for freeing me from my prison. Let me introduce you. This is the true ruler of Dharma Temple, High Priest Fossey. I am the High Priest of Dharma, but that title is an empty one now. Monsters have overwhelmed the land. Even as we speak, there is a false high priest presiding above. Why is there all this noise? This is supposed to be a prison. Look, it's the guy who snuck past us in the cave. Oh man, I'll be damned if I'm fighting those guys. They're still full of the power they stole from us. They stole that power? In that case, let me return it. Ah, my strength! All right, take care of them while they're weakened. Pan and companions, HP recovered. Damn it, you'll regret doing that, woman. I'll swallow your soul. Okay, here we go. Totally healed, which is very nice. And does this mean I can heal again? Because that'd be really nice. Oh yeah, no, we still don't have our spells. That's fine. Oh, she doesn't have cat ears. It's just her hat or whatever, exactly. Fight, fight. Um, item. Use your... On guns. Okay, well he didn't fall asleep, but it's good to know that's the how that works. Um item use your wonder rock.
fight. Do, do, ca uh, not cast item. Use your wonder rock on pan. Scoundrels were far too strong. I could use a break. Thank you for all you've done for me. We'd better get out of here before any more monsters find us. Flower and I will go ahead and give the priest the good news. Could you escort Fossey back to the village pen? Let's go, Flower. Please, let me accompany you back to town. Ooh, Fossey joined the party. Heck yeah. Alright, we can just walk out of here now. Do 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 do. Wrong way. Nice. Oh, I think I took the wrong way just now. Or maybe not. Oh yes, I did. I believe I did take the wrong way. Thanks for the hydrate! Ding. I think this is the way we came up from. There we go. Oh no, I didn't get lost. I just took the wrong exit initially. But me knew where I was going. Boom, boom, Wait a second. How did we get in this room in the first place? Okay, maybe now I'm actually lost. <laughs> this is where we made it to. Where was the door in here? Was it this one? Aha, uh -huh, got it. Duke, 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 duke. I remembered that room very clearly and then I couldn't remember what we were up to. Do we want to go back to the town? Maybe we'll go to the town first. The high priest is back! I knew the high priest was still alive. Oh, high priest Fossey, I'm so relieved. This is the greatest day of my life. Now that Fossey is back, maybe we can take Dharma back. It is my fault that you were all forced into these horrendous circumstances. While I was confined, I suffered the same pain that all of you did. But now all of that is over. Let's combine our forces to take back the Dharma that is our home. Enjoy things while you can. There's no future for any of you. I told the monsters you rescued the high priest, so they're going to teach you a lesson real soon. Yeah, not surprised about that. Ragnets, oh, this totally not super important part of the game, right? <laughs> if 
We're gonna get our classes. Vincent Kane winter is coming. I sure the heck hope so. I'm a little warm. Ragnats, the monsters are going to teach you a lesson real soon. And not just any lesson, you're going to get schooled in advanced calculus. Perfect. Aha! Okay. Have a great night, Dodoku. Thank you so much for hanging out. Rest well and be safe. Are you trying to say that your brother happened to come back while we were away? He was taken away by monsters. I can't believe he escaped and came back on his own. Don't speak to her like that. She can't talk at all. I don't really know myself. You owe a great deal to Pan and his friends, too. Thank you all so much for all you've done. As you can see, my brother is back safe again without injury. Neris, what happened to the hair ornament? What? The hair ornament? The hair ornament I gave you? Oh, that. I, uh, lost it. I see. And how are you feeling? Are you all better? Sure, I'm fine. What of it? Why do you ask me these silly questions? Mm, this ain't Neris. This ain't Neris at all. Hey, monster, how do I do taxes, Captain Giraffe? Vespender, is Pam behind on his schoolwork? Does Fishbell even have a school? Thank you, everyone. I wish there was some way I could express my gratitude. Hey, somebody's talking to you. Why don't you answer? Can't talk with your soul shattered? You poor thing. Saji is muttering something. Pan listened closely. My sister isn't here. Where did she go? Don't leave me all alone. Just as Zaji returned, the head priest disappeared. Can you explain that? I hate to bother you, but we are in desperate need of your help. Please defeat the imposter high priest. We can enter Dharma through the underground passage with this key. <laughs> yeah, not real oops camps. <laughs> I just thought you were very, um, very invested in this Nekomichi. It looks like you're carrying too much already. I'll put it into this bag. The chief priest Fossey put the Dharma key in the bag. Pan got the Dharma key. Perfect. I've been informed that the power the high priest has stolen are store the powers the high priest has stolen are stored somehow in a strange room. If we can get to that room, we may be able to return all of those powers to the people. We'd better get going. There are four of us. Maybe it'd be better to split up. Don't tell me you're taking these two with you. They'll only be a burden. If you hate going with us so much, why don't you just stay here by yourself? What did you say? Hey, Kasim, this girl's really changed. Vincent Kane, I barely remember any of this game. Remember the music, though? It's pretty consistent to long Dragon Quest, but yeah, it's so good. Enter the upper cave and go to the right. You'll come to a wider area with a locked door. We'll be waiting for you there. Come as quickly as you can. I'll recruit the bravest guards that are left and we'll follow when you're ready. Use the Dharma key to open the locked door and sneak into the temple before us. Okay, we got it. Let's just, oh, you know what? We'll save the game real quick first. Oops. Did not mean to save the third slot, but whatever. Now we got three slots going.
Welcome. Could I please borrow the key Fosse gave to you? I'll only need it for a minute. Why do you need the key? I can see through you. Show me who you really are. Ah, uh, ha, ha. I guess I'm just no good at pretending to be human. But I didn't like being an ugly human anyway. To think that my disguise would be discovered by s discovered so quickly. Oh well, might as well take care of you here anyway. Wait, where is Neris and the head priest? The woman still lives, but I ate the old man alive. Ee hee 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 hee. Oh no, you don't. I think this kid wants a piece of you first. Look, Saji, your soul sword. Now you can get your revenge. Oh. Destroy that man's soul. Let your hatred guide your sword. And meanwhile, I'll make a lunch out of the rest of you. Ee hee hee hee. Wow. Item, use the Wonder Rock on yourself. Fight, item, use the Wonder Rock on Gabo. Is his name Man Eater or Man Eater? I'm pretty sure he's a Man Eater. <laughs> Level up. Woohoo, level 18 pan. Way to go. Die, Kasim. I'll make you stay out of my sister's life forever. Kasim, he's just a kid. Finish him off already. I can't. Saji's sword is draining all my strength away. Ah, my sword! Now to finish you. Ah, my sword! Oh, soul of Zaji, return to your rightful owner. Ah! You, you killed him? If you've killed him, Kasim, you'll never receive our help. <laughs> Whoa, here he comes. Watch out, boy, he'll eat you up. Whoa, here he comes. He's a man eater. Where's Kiefer? We le Kiefer left us. Kiefer found the girl of his dreams and his true calling, and he, um, he went his own way. Right through the solar plexus, right, Vincent? No, that sword contains Z K Zaji's soul. Maybe now his soul will return to his body. Vincent, do we not get Kiefer back? I don't remember, to be honest. No, I think he's Gonzo Gonzo for good Zo. Kiefer chose marriage. Um, Ragnets, do you still have the knife he used to stab you in the back? I'm actually, I actually don't care for Kiefer, so I'm fine with him being gone. I just like that he, uh... He was a strong tank, but I'm okay with that. He's gone. <laughs> it's kind of a boring lame character. Well, he sure looks dead to me, Kasim. You sure about this? Hey, are you all right? Are you feeling okay? I'm fine. That monster was controlling me. Then why did you turn your blade against me after we defeated the foe? I'm sorry. I never wanted to kill you, but the soul sword was controlling me. Its dark power made me want to kill everyone. I sure the heck did. Okay. I believe you. I suppose that it was the sword that wasn't controlling you. That was controlling you. The other side of this door should lead to Dharma Temple Pan. If we hurry, we might still be able to save Neris. 
Oh, why did I have to worry so much about the priest? Damn it. Just get that cursed door open, Pan. Yeah, okay. My sister must be alive, but she's in danger. We've got to save her. I had no idea that Neris was a monster, let alone a fat and ugly one. When do you think they pulled the switch on us? When we were gone? Obviously. Not too hard to figure out, detective. Okay, item, use the wonder rock on pan. here? Anything secret? No? Nice. Not the frigid breath. Rude. Fight. Item. Use your wonder rock on pan. herbs here. Losing our heal spells is always a real bummer, you know? Oh, a beak rat. Thanks, Best Bender. Have a great night. Rest well. Be safe. For the classes, I'm probably going to just look at a guide real quick just to make sure I have the best ones for ourselves. <laughs> when in doubt, go for mages because magic is cool. I always am actually a physical attacker in games like this, but yes, I will want like a nice cleric here for sure. Ooh, an evil pot. A mariner and dancer. Right. We want those two. And I'm guessing we want to make, um... I'm guessing we want to make, um, a pan a mariner, right? Hi, boss dog. How you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? Nice. Sweet chili heat. Vincent, my sub expired for these emotes from Toki 20 seconds ago. Oh no! Isn't that just the way it happens? Mm -hmm. 
Regnets. I feel like I remember making Gabo a Beastmaster. I don't think I have the ability to have a Beastmaster yet. Boss Dog, no problem. Played a little Factory with a friend earlier on the way to go to bed. I'm gonna listen while I fall asleep. Oh, that's nice. Thanks so much for choosing the panda party for your sleepy time. Sleepy times? What? I don't know. But how was Factorio? Did you have a good time with Factorio? I've considered playing Factorio, but it's just not... Those kind of games just get me all all worked up, you know? All nervous. Too much, too much stuff to manage. Oh my. The door is shut tightly, okay. Oh, I see. This is a trick, a trick thing. Captain Joe, speaking of emotes, I got gifted a sub to someone I watched for like five minutes and I got things like this. Oh, those are really, really good. <laughs> I love that slow poke. And those are good Gengars. Good night, Mr. Johnny Ringo. Rest well and be safe. Okay, one. Ooh, money. One of these is going to be an evil pot, right? Oh, there it is. There it is. Right there. Right there. The evil pots are kind of cute, though. I like their evil little eyes and their little grins. Oh, good. More dung. They don't have any Pikachus for some reason, but they had all the rest of the three starters. Oh, that's, that's cute. I like that. I do like those starters. They're in the 90s, it's fine, they'll be fine. I'm kind of like rushing through this dungeon, but well, I'm not like fully exploring it because I just want to find the the door shut tightly. Shoot. I'm definitely looking to get into the um Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm looking to um get my powers back and then I'll come back and fully explore this dungeon if I need to. Never mind. No squirrel for some reason. Squirtle? You mean? <laughs> hey Specs, how are you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? 
Vincent Kane, there are 54 character classes, 10 basic classes, 7 intermediate classes, 3 expert classes, and 34 monster classes. You can change classes freely if you recall correctly at least. I like this guy's class guide. I won't try to lie to you. I hate Dragon Warrior 7. It is quite possibly the most arduous, te tedious, laborious RPG I've ever played. I find no redeeming value in this game. It is not fun, nor is it entertaining. Oh my gosh, I love this game so much. <laughs> Squirtle, take autocorrect into account. You knew what I meant. Of course, as I stared at it for a while. I'm like, what are you referring to as squirrel? And I remembered, oh, right, probably autocorrect. Gotcha. I'm like the classiest, you know? Okay, now I'm like, how do I get out of this place? They wouldn't have a blocker like to prevent you from, like you'd have to be able to get out. I can't just get you stuck in here forever. It's a trap! I mean, yes, but also, <laughs> games can't just have you stuck so you have to restart the whole dang thing. Fight item, use your wonder rock. Um, hmm. Bed. We got some of the nice moon. Her I only have one. Oh, cure paralysis. That's what a moon her dubs. Dang. Um, we're getting low on herbs here. Missing here. Okay. I need to look this up. I'm like, I'm not actually stucco, am I? Um. <laughs> okay. And actually, actually, I just have to use the washer. We right, right back, everyone. Don't go or do what you got to do. But I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back, and Nekomichi, you want to talk about nudes, you have to talk about it N-O-O-D-S. That's the joke. So you say send nudes, but spelling it like noodles. Because <laughs> otherwise you throw us all into confusion like Captain Giraffe did. <laughs> like I mean, like Captain Giraffe was confused, like I'm confused. We don't want anyone confused with N-U-D-E-S. It's funny to say the joke nudes, but it's got to be spelt appropriately. <laughs> Yeah, not around here. I think it's too easy to get confused. <laughs> um, whenever the mods aren't around, yeah. No, we want to. Okay, so I'm... Oh, how did this work this time? Oh my gosh. Oh, I know. I just... Haven't had, uh, haven't been around to fix it, so. It'll get fixed soon. Whatever, you didn't know. Nekomichi pointed it out to me the other night. I saw it there on Monday and Tuesday. <laughs> I'm providing a valuable service here. You're right, you are. Absolutely. Thank you. What? Okay, we're going to avoid that zone right now. I don't think it's where we're supposed to go, so. Let's. Well, fine. <laughs> you did. You're right. You did a great job. Thank you very much. Do you think this is the room Fossey was talking about? Oh, there we go. Well, this will make this whole thing much easier. <laughs> yes, I'm regaining my strength. The companions have regained all of their spells and abilities. I can't believe I just walked past this thing. Suddenly, you hear the voice of the High Priest Fossey. Wonderful! Your power has returned! Take the passage to the left. I will keep you in my prayers. Okay, I can't believe... Well, there. I can't believe I just passed that. I thought that would go upstairs, so I was taking the side zone, but... You're right. Is that what you want me to say? No. <laughs> Okay, that's a shut tightly door. Oh yes, we can use spells again, which means we can now heal our characters, which I probably should do now that we can do that. We should be able to finish this fight without anyone dying. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Item. I mean, not item. Uh, cast, because we have our heals back. Bless my soul. Jake, on so only two days until the art stream. Have you given any thought on how we're going to decide on the new emote? Well, one of them is the Gengar uh, that we've talked about. And then uh, the second one, we will just have to all decide as a crew here. Uh, though there is a lot of a lot of contenders for sure.
yeah, I figured we wasted it to get to this point. Yeah, we'll we'll talk it over. We'll figure it all out. Absolutely not, Vincent King. That is the last thing that uh, the panda will put around here. Don't I? Do, I hate them. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but whatever. Not on brand for the Pando Party, exacto. We got some weird slowdown here. Ooh, an agility seed, fantastic. Vampando does deserve her, e her own emote. I agree. We probably should get a Vampando out here. Item, cast, heal, let's get those heals out on Maribel. Yeah, that's good. Captain Draft Aura, OMG, I'm blinking on Whip Lady's name from Ace Attorney. Oh, uh, Francesca Von Karma you are referencing. Francesca would be pretty cool, but, um... I don't really know how I would make a good one of her. I don't think I'd have I don't think I have the skills to make a, a Francesca von Karma. But maybe one eventually. Whoa, do not lick me. we go. Ooh, it's all, it's all one. That's why the game can hardly handle it. It's all one big room. Do you like any Western RPGs? Of course. I really love the Mass Effect series. Um, I also really enjoy uh, Fallout. Um, though I haven't played one for a long time because there really hasn't been one for a long time. Um, yeah. I mean, I've never really gotten into Baldur's Gate, Neverwinter Nights, or like Divinity Original Sin just because I was never really super into uh, PC games in my youth. Um... So, and a lot of, a lot of Western RPGs were like CRPGs, like computer RPGs, um, which I just never had a lot of, um, but I do, I like, I like all games. I like pretty much all video games, uh, if they're good. I'll tell you what I don't like though, Fable. I don't like Fable, so... Fable could be good. It just hasn't been good for me. Ooh. 
LOL, I bought an Xbox just to play Fable 3, then returned it. That's kind of funny. Jake, I never really saw you as someone that would like the Mass Effect games. Yeah, I really like the Mass Effect games. Like, I stinking love the Mass Effect games. Um, when it comes to amazing characters, Legion is one, Morden is one. I mean, those games are full of cool aliens. <laughs> Jake, I'm kidding. I remember I someone saw that said that once. <laughs> yeah, those games are like super, um, super good with their cool aliens and stuff. Oh, I can heal. I just keep forgetting I can heal. Do you like Miranda Lawson? I'm, I'm pretty okay with Miranda. Francesca Von Karma doesn't seem to have a shrug animation. She doesn't shrug all that often. She mostly whips people in anger. What is your stance on the Krogan genophage? Uh, the Krogans deserve better. I'm pro Krogan because I'm super pro dinosaur. And I will heal the genophage every single time. I thought they were frogs. They look like dinosaurs. I mean, I love frogs too, so. <laughs> I mean, Rex is the best. Um, Grunt is also super rad. Yeah, dino frogs, exactly. Big old dino frogs. Love them. Didn't they use frog DNA in Jurassic Park? You sure they sure did. Dinosaurs. Jake, I've really wanted to play the Mass Effect games for a long time. Going to have to do that sometime soon. Yeah, the first game I think is the It's the most RPG-ish, but I think it's like fun but I think that the second game is just the best best yeah you gotta get the legendary edition welcome to the arena human oh good love an arena this is a weapon and armor shop how can I help you okay chain whip oh dang it we need that Maribel Okay, steel sword, have it. Steel claw. No, I want to keep him with his boomerang. I don't really care about him having a steel claw. Evade, everyone's got. Ooh, I don't have this yet. I guess I'll have to sell. Ooh, the captain hat. Oh, boy. Okay, let's um sell some stuff. Oh, if you want to share a link, you just have to uh, give it to one of the mods. Just whisper it to one of the mods and they'll... Uh, They'll post it for you. Don't you sell my hat? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm going to buy your hat, Captain Giraffe. Is that everything there? I don't want this. Yeah, oh. What am I doing? I guess I don't need the kitten shield. Um, I kind of don't need the wizard whatever, but... Vincent Kane, fancy filter. It wasn't like that a year ago on Twitch, was it? No, I have it set personally. I had way too many weird links thrown into chat. So I just have links turned off automatically unless you're a mod. So don't, it's not a personal thing or anything. It's just, 
had too many weird links shared in chat from randos uh, throughout the throughout the years. Yeah. <laughs> Oops, I want to buy stuff now. Okay, so we got it. Don't want it. Don't want it. Got it. Okay, iron. The iron whatever. Actually, I think I had this already. And I, no, did I? I can't remember. Mm, it's better, so we'll... Uh, yes, but first I'm going to sell what I have. Oops. Oh my gosh. Let me sell things. I'm going to buy things now. Oh my gosh. I'm failing here. Okay, good, 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 perfect. Okay, Captain Hat, we're gonna afford one. Yes, I will sell. The Iron Helm. Okay, is there a little... I'm probably not going to use this wizard thingy, so I'm going to sell it too. Okay, so I wonder if there's a place where we can heal up before fighting in the thingy. The monsters finally gave me my powers back, but now they won't let me out of this godforsaken place. Is there like a little inn or whatever? Welcome to our temple, O oh Lost Lamb of God. What may we do for you? Yes, I would love to save the game. Thank you. Brig, I'm always winning. How are you doing? What's going on over there? What are you up to? Damn monsters, look what they've done to this fane. And here I thought we'd be back in Dharma once we left the cave. Okay, this is probably to register for the thingy. Oh, long time no see. I remember you well. You were in town when I went soul harvesting. Remember that kid whose soul I didn't completely shatter? Well, his sister's trying to extract revenge on me now in the arena. Ha ha ha. How could a sickly young girl like her ever defeat me? That warrior swordsmanship is truly wonderful to watch. No wonder he was able to escape from Suifu. When my soul was taken, Neris was the only one who looked after me. But now she's a completely different person. Just finished farming your brutal set? Nice. Ever since Neris started using the soul sword, she's become one of the most vicious fighters I've seen. I've got to win. I have to get out of this place. Oh, I'm worried sick about my wife and kids. Ah, oh, that was close. Almost had a little accident there. What? The front of my pants are soaking wet. Oh, it's just sweat. Ha <laughs> I must be sweating a lot. Neris took up the soul sword to avenge her brother. What are you doing, Neris? Why do you have that soul sword? Come on, give me that sword. You'll feel a lot better. No, 
Don't get near me. Leave me alone. I thought I could finally die in peace in this godforsaken arena. Everyone knows what a weak little girl I am anyway. What's wrong, Neris? You're acting so weird. You'll feel better if you give me the soul sword. Just go away. Do you want your soul taken too? Why, you pestilent ingrate. Oh, no, you don't. Neris chose to raise the soul sword in battle herself. I'm letting her live because I want to see how she'll do. I'm not going to allow you to end my fun, human. Sweating a lot, right, Jake? Hmm, yes, yeah, sweating a lot. Neris chose to raise the soul sword in battle herself. All right, here, she just said that. Oh, my chest, please leave me alone. Neris wants the soul of the man who attacked her brother. She'll fight on and on in the arena until she gets to him. Well, another day, another RPG with an arena section. Let's go. I don't think anyone particularly enjoys being here, and I'm sure any one of us would escape if we had the chance. Everyone's too afraid to try for themselves, though. It never been done before. Literally never seen this before in my life. No one here trusts anyone enough to form an arena party. Most people just take three monsters with them. Only arena champions may pass through this door. Go win an arena tournament, then we'll talk. I'd be lying if I said I hate arena, arenas, casinos, or... I hate arenas or casinos in games. Fair. I kind of like... They make me happy. Our power has returned, and there's a lot of anger going around. If something sets us off, we'd probably start a revolt. I reclaim my powers and my sword and my powers, but I can't fight against the monsters alone. I would ask you to join me, but I don't even trust my friends, let alone strangers. Woo, seven gold. Woo, we're rich. Woo. Listen, do you promise not to tell this to anyone? The monsters robbed us of our power in order to strengthen the demon lord. Oh, don't tell anyone. If they found out that I knew, they'd kill me. They'd probably kill you too. It's not that surprising, really. Even a skilled burglar like me couldn't open that door. I guess the only way to get past here really is just to win the tournament. Ah, yes. The door is tightly shut, of course, of course. Okie dokie, back inside. There's a woman with a soul sword in this tournament. She's amazing. I didn't think a human could last that long against those huge monsters. People who fight with a soul sword all end up the same. They eventually go mad and die, screaming in agony. All weapons weaken over time, even a soul sword. But when a soul sword weakens, the pair of soul writhes in pain and dementia sets in. We have destroyed the souls of many people here. Only few were lucky enough to come back alive. Since everyone got their power back, the arena battles have been incredible. I can't believe Neris entered the tournament. That's why I've got to enter the tournament too. It's the only way we'll ever get my sister back. We need to acquire the soul sword and use it to force Neris's soul back into her body. Maybe then she'll come back to her senses. Let me help you. I don't need your help. I can do it without you. Jeez, doesn't he get it? This is no time to be worrying about your pride. Sadji doesn't have anyone he can rely on except for you. I'm sure he'll ask for your help eventually. I know he's a hassle, but please do what you can for him. You're trying to return to Dar you're trying to return to Dharma Temple, aren't you? The easiest way to do that is to win in the arena. I need to do the same thing in order to save my sister, so we should ally with each other. Will you join me? Really? You will? Thank you so much. Our goals may be different, but let's win this together. Zaji joined the party.
Ah, there's the inn. You want to know how to get out of here? Yes. If you manage to win five straight battles in the arena, you'll be set free. Perfect. Welcome to our inn. One night is six gold. Would you like to stay? Yes, please. Pear Bear, the arena is where you got stuck the last time you played this. Interesting. Okay, I'm going to just kind of run around in circles out here just a little bit because I want... I want to have um, 800 gold. And how are you doing, Pear Bear? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? What'd you have for dinner, by the way? I had a little Hobie pizza on a pita bread. So it was like a he mostly healthy pizza. Lots of uh, vegetables and some ground bison on there. It was really delicious. What about you? What did everyone else have for dinner today? Pear Bear, McDonald's a quarter, McDonald's, quarter pounder and nuggets. Nice. Jake, a few peanut butter sandwiches. Hey, that's okay. So question, Jake, do you put butter on your peanut butter sandwiches? Or do you just eat, like, put peanut butter in bread? Brig, air fried sliced potatoes with chili and cheese poured over them. Well, that sounds decadent. Just peanut butter and bread? Nice. And what kind of bread? Um, you know, my mothy used to always put a bit of butter because she said it was too dry otherwise. Um, and so sometimes, not always. Like, with toast, I feel like the peanut butter kind of gets melty, so I don't need to do it. But maybe sometimes when I make a sandwich, I do that. John Bonsai, how are you doing? What's going on? What's on the up and up, my friend? Whole wheat bread? Nice. Captain Giraffe, I had some chicken tenders and fries from Way Back Burger. I still recommend it, but I feel like the tenders could have been a, could have had a crispier batter. Interesting, interesting. That sounds really great, though. Enchilada, shrimp with peas, panko shrimp. Ooh, that sounds delicious. Jake, I prefer whole wheat. Nice. I am uh, usually a rye bread person because I love toast the very most. And toast makes, uh, rye bread makes amazing toast, but. Jumbanzai. Hey, yo, it's going well. Just chilling tonight on some World of Warcraft. Are you playing classic uh, Wrath of the Lich King stuff? Or are you playing, uh, are you getting prepped up for uh, the dragon expansion? Ragnat, someone should make a skyscraper construction simulator and just advertise the game as having riveting gameplay. Oh, no. Vincent Kane, that's kind of gross to be honest. Butter only goes on raisin bread or raisin bagels. Um, when I say butter, I actually mean margarine, and I don't know if that makes it worse for some people or not. But um, I haven't had a lot of... I grew up without a lot of butter in my life, and it was mostly margarine. Um, shrimp Alfredo, nice. I mean, not nice, I hate Alfredo, but uh, that sounds good for folks who like it. How's Dragon Warrior going? It's going incredible. Jake, I don't think I've ever tried rye bread. Really? It's um it's definitely it's definitely a fave of mine. Uh classy classic. Getting ready for Wrath. Super excited for it. This game is such a classic. Man, 
folks, like, I... I can't play World of Warcraft Classic. Like, I... Don't get me wrong. I... Obsessed with World of Warcraft. Obsessed with Wrath of the Lich King. I probably played... Like, I've been playing World of Warcraft since the Classic. Like, vanilla days. Um, and I... Have played the same character across almost all of the games, all all the expansions, and I I'm I will still resubscribe for the stupid dragon expansion coming out, but I just cannot do the old stuff. I'm like I've been here, I've done this, I've lived this life. I don't need to do it again. <laughs> Jake Margarine is a bastard spread, like butane is to gas. Wow. Mm, okay. Well, I will fully admit that I like margarine here John Bonsai yeah I didn't know you played love it yep been playing since vanilla as well yes I uh, I was a had a human holy priest in uh, vanilla and I ran you know uh, molten core uh, blackwing lair but never got to Nexoramus um, and then like uh, when I say I played World of Warcraft I was you know Never one of those people who like devoted their entire lives to it. Um, but I was obsessed. Like I read all the World of Warcraft books. I made sure to go to BlizzCons. I met Chris Metzen and I shook his hand and I like lost my dang mind. Um, I was like obsessed with World of Warcraft. Um, and, uh, and then Brooding Crusade came out. I was there for the midnight release, you know. I made my Blood Elf Holy Priest and I've been there. I was there from, you know, that my Blood Elf Holy Priest has been my main since then. Uh, though I haven't played since uh, I hated Shadowlands, so. <laughs> but I just, I can't do any of the classic stuff. Um, You just loved Wrath so much you want to play it again. It's totally fair. I, I mean, Wrath is so flippin' good. Uh, Vince and Kane, I quit when they nerfed my Blood Elf Paladin tank. Oh, no. Um, woo. Uh, I'm playing for the PvP, so that's highly replayable. That's, I understand. Pear Bear Next was easy, but did the Wrath of the Lich King version? Yes, me too. That's where, when Wrath of the Lich King came out, I had, like, a guild. We were, um, we were pushing. Because the thing with Wrath of the Lich King was it let smaller guilds play, like, higher-end content. Because they had, um, they had all the 10 man, like you could raid anything at, with 10 people. And that was very, very cool. So I got to run Nax and we were, uh, doing, um, ooh, I can't remember the name of the stupid, uh, Titan place right now. Ulduar? Ul, yes, Ulduar. Woo, I did it. Yes, <laughs> Ulduar. We were running Ulduar and, um... We were doing it competitively and I realized like we were, our raids were getting so tense and everyone was getting so angry and we were dying and wiping and I was like, you know what? I think I'm done so. And ever since that, like ever since like that, my World of Warcraft, War, World of Warcraft experience has been almost exclusively solo. Like I got um, the Panda expansion and I played all of the quests, you know, and then I, you know, just oh cataclysm obviously uh but ever since wrath of the lich king i've played that game totally solo i just run old content to try to find farm uh, mounts and old tier gear um and i never i never engage in any <laughs> multiplayer stuff which is really funny for an mmo but anyway um that's my my rant um jake i always had margarine as a kid but once i started shopping for myself and using butter there was no going back i actually i kind of like margarine so um, I'm starting to hijack chat with World of Warcraft. It's okay. I get real excited talking about WoW sometimes. Vincent came. I, I did come back for Cataclysm. Pick a Death Knight was pretty cool, but dropped off a few months later because life got busy. Totally. Um, Regnats. The answer for that clue was I'm on a roll and I was so happy. <laughs> you love Uldor so much. I love going back and running Uldor now. I just love it. I love it so much. Uh, Pear Bear, I have the horse from doing the Trials of the Crusader hard mode deathless. That is very cool. My group is a little salty. I got the first one because the previous week we just had one death. Me in the first fight. Oh no. <laughs> and they're like, why is it you? What are you doing here? No, what I do is I try to farm the Ashes of Alar. I try to get my Onyxia mount. And I fail to get them both every time. 
And that's what I do. That's how I roll. Ten man to clarify. Yeah, of course. Sorry, I got real distracted there. Here I am be grinding. I could have been having this whole conversation while grinding. I don't know what I'm doing here. Pear Bear, we couldn't manage to get 25 mans together for anything past an axe. Me neither. And I guess, like, I was never uh, helpful for that because I was always like, man, World of Warcraft ain't a job for me. Like, I don't want to have a scheduled time. Like, I guess we did have, I did come for the scheduled raids. Uh, but I just, you know, it was just so hard. I just, I hated, I hated the idea of, like, having raid nights. I'm like, what if I don't want to play World of Warcraft tonight? What if I want to do something else? <laughs> Raid nights are rough, right? And it's like so hard to explain to people who don't play the game. You're like, um, I can't hang out. Uh, I have to raid. And then people are like, what? Like you have to play a video game instead of hang out with your friends? And I'm like, eh, well, you know. <laughs> Break. I did all the 40 mans in classic World of Warcraft. It was fantastic. Loved it. The 40 mans were really fun because it felt like it took a lot of the pressure off to perform, especially since I've always been a healer. Like, with 40 people, like, yes, you have to be, like, on top of the ball, but, like, it's not all your fault. Whereas, like, I guess, like, it's kind of the same in 25 mans now, but... Gosh, I hate. You hang out with your guild friends, though. I healed them, too. Yeah, I've always had trouble explaining to my family and, like, real-life friends that I was going to hang out with, um, with my guild friends that night. Captain Giraffe, you have to defeat the enemy. You don't have time to explain what the enemy is Beth. What? Pear Bear, our guild leaders were a big fan of the vanilla 40-man raid, so it sometimes we'd just go steamroll them for fun. Heck, yeah. Why the enemy is bad. Oh, yes, 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 of course. Hey, RPG Network. Jake, that's what always put me off on MMOs. Right? I mean, it's fun. Like, it's fun when there's a lot of your friends just playing naturally. Um, so that... Like, that's been one of the really nice things about Final Fantasy XIV. Is that I can play with my friends again because... I can just like ask people to hey I'm online does anyone want to run a few things and then people are like yeah sure I'm around and that's nice but with World of Warcraft no one was ever around ever since Cataclysm none of my friends were playing so <laughs> Brig you could also just pug all the contact pretty easy in classic yeah I don't like to play with strangers in World of Warcraft they're so much more mean Although, you know, back like back in the old days when I was like level 60, I guess when that was the level cap and it's a level cap again. But <laughs> before the big level shrinking, I would like before they even had like the the um, dungeon finder or whatever, I would just go into the LFG channel and I would advertise my group be like, hey, I'm a healer, we're looking for a tank, just looking for a chill group. And then I'd always find really fun people to play with that way. But I feel like when they added in the dungeon finder, I kind of took out that like, being able to be like, hey, I just want chill people. I don't really know what I'm doing. I don't want to read about the fights before going in. I just want to have a good time. You know? Bootless Pit, Night Pando, Night Chat. Good night, Bootless Pit. Thanks so much for hanging out. Rest well. Be safe. Captain Giraffe, I swear I've been noticing this recently. Autocorrect will just change my words or it won't. And it just won't make sense. And it's like, bro, you have my back. What happened? Right? <laughs> I found that too. You're like, that's going to... Surely my autocorrect will fix this. And then it doesn't. And you're like, what? Why not? Brick, I agree. Retail people are mean. I just want to be able to like advertise a, 
a dungeon run and be like, I'm just looking to have a chill, fun time. Please, no shouting. And then everyone's like... Mika! Yeah, I'll join your cool group. And I'm like, yeah, thanks. But they don't really have that for anything other than, like, mythics anymore. And I don't want to run no mythic. I just want to get the uh, original dungeon out of the way for the story stuff. Anyway, that's my World of Warcraft rant. Thanks for coming out, folks. <laughs> okay, 2,500. We need 300 more gold. Brig. Earlier in the year, I returned to retail to tank a low-level dungeon, and the three DPS attacked me for not knowing the most ideal tanking path. So I just started pulling random mobs until they left. Oh, man. Yeah, people, right? They're the worst. That's the one thing I really enjoy about Final Fantasy XIV. I'll be like, uh, I don't know. And then people are like, okay, just follow me. And you're like, okay, yay. <laughs> Captain Giraffe, like, why did bad get changed to bath? Not a real word, right? It's rude. Come on, autocorrect. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to heal Gabo. Jake, oh, I was just going to say people are the worst, right? They're, they're no good. Nice. Um, 2600, okay. Keep going. Almost there. Like sometimes I think maybe Thanos isn't such a bad guy. <laughs> oh no. You can't, you can't think that way. Almost have enough money for what I gotta do. Boop, boop, boop. Almost have enough money for what I gotta do. Well, look at these guys are just so funny. Like, they're just like. Look at the little faces. They're like. And I like it. Cool, why didn't you use that spell earlier, dude? Okay, just pretty much um, 101 more golds. Was this spell called Heal USA? I think it was Heal Us A, but <laughs> it looked like it's like Heal USA. <laughs> yes, Heal the US. Oh, I forgot to heal Maribel. Hmm. 
There we go. Uh, cast, heal, Maribel. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Running around in circles. Oh, very, very handy. Brilliant work, team. Woo, we did it! 2817, two, perfect. Now we can buy the new captain hat. And that will be for Gabo. Uh, yes, now I would like to sell. Hmm. All right, the fur hat, that's what he was wearing. No, me good, thank you. Okay, let's rest and then start this arena party. I would like to save the video game, please. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, stink, of course. Reset game. I pressed the wrong button. We're not ready to end yet. We all get to hear the PlayStation sound again, so can't complain about that. Hey, Shockwave. How are you doing tonight? What's going on? What's on the up and up? I would like some popcorn. Sure, I'll take some popcorn. Why not? Popcorn. I love popcorn. Aha, uh -huh. here we are, 30 hours in. Hey you, do you want to dare the arena? Yes please. Four people, good, you may proceed. <laughs> you want to know the rules of the arena? Yes please. It's simple. Two parties of four fight it out to the death. When one side's victorious, they go right into the next battle. If you lose a match, you're out of the competition. But if you win five matches in a row, you'll become a champion. If you can beat the old champion, then you will be granted freedom. Come on, get going. I have challengers waiting for you. Perfect. Proceed, challengers! Pan, this is your first battle. Begin! Okay, we can handle this. We can handle Nepro and the Drax Slimes.
Rude. Okay, fight, cast, heal, Gabo. There we go. Pan is the winner! Next challenger, forward! Battle to begin! So we got Garcia in the Bolt Rats. Ooh, you want my new Slowpoke? Okay. Ouchie, ouchie. Okay, let me just go grab him. I'll be right, right back. immediately on hand <gasps> I well he was he's a good snuggle buddy okay <laughs> he gets snuggled with <laughs> okay fight um fight Garcia fight the bolt rats fight Fight Garcia. Cast heal on uh, yourself. Ooh, nice. Be careful, Peta Pita Pickle Pepper Pan Pan. These enemies look pretty tough. They are, but we're doing okay. We're gonna be just fine. Gotta level up here, folks. Gabo is now also level 18 with us. Pan is the winner! Next challenger, forward! Battle 3, begin! Okay. 
We've got Thompson in the Goopies. Wow, rude. Okay, fight, cast, heal on a pan. Ooh, nice. Love a crit hit. Pen is the winner! Woo! Yeah! Next challenger, forward! Battle 4, begin! We've got Naputo and the Smoochers. Um, okay, fight Naputo, fight the Smoochers, fight! Oh yeah, Pando does have this. Ooh, nice. Angelot, it's like magic watching Pando. Snaps fingers and poof, she knocks out the bad guys and moves on. Heck yeah. That's right. <laughs> Woohoo! There we go. Pan is the winner! Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Next challenger, forward! Battle five, begin. So this must not be the champion. It must have to fight the champion after I beat five battles. So technically I need six battles to get out of here. Don Jose, okay. <laughs> uh, cast, oh no, fight the beak rats. fight. Okay, you're gonna have to be the healer right now, because Maribel's sleeping. Okay, oops. Oh yeah, we got shuttered, I see. Uh, fight. Cast, heal on Gabo. Got a level up. Hello. Love that. 
Ooh, Maribel's now level 19. Pan is the winner! Win this next battle and your freedom will be granted to you. Next challenger, forward! Final battle, begin! So you've come to kill me too, Sachi? What, can't you do it by yourself? I've got to save my sister, Pan. That demonic sword is still controlling her. Ooh, this is the first one that kind of looks like the character. It's kind of cool. Um, okay, let's go. Fight. Neris. Fight. The Slime Knights. Fight. Okay, fight. Cast heal on yourself. And you fight. Ooh, nice. You do your thing. Ooh, ouchie, ouchie. Okay, fight. Cast heal on yourself, Maribel. Fight, cast, heal on Gabo. Nice. Rude, rude, rude. You can throw a heal down. And you can throw a heal down. You can uh, cast a heal on Gabo. You can cast a heal on yourself. Ooh, she just snowstorming us to death now. Oh no! Okay, you're gonna use your world leaf on Gabo. You're going to cast a heal on yourself. Okay, and now you will cast a no, no, no. You will fight. You will cast the heal on Pan. Oh, there we go. Perfect timing. Great, Pan! You managed to get the sword away from her! Return, Soul Sword, to your rightful place! Ah! Now, Neris will return back to normal! Pan is the winner! We hereby grant you your freedom from the arena! Congratulations, champions. Please come this way. Wait, she's not awake yet. Come on, come on, move it. We need to clean up for the next battle. But...
Kasim! My sister! You've got to save my sister! Right. What's wrong? Don't just stand there. Get going. Pen, I must bid you farewell. Thank you for fighting alongside me. I do appreciate the help. I'm worried about my sister, so I must return to the Coliseum. Take care of what you need to do. Don't let him run away. Grab him. Wait. Sorry to surprise you. Do you remember me? I'm Fossey, the High Priest. I came along with you to fight the imposter. My honor would suffer if I were to just sit on the sidelines and wait for someone else to win the battle for me. Okay, in the name of justice, let's go defeat that priest imposter monster. All right. Are we finally going to finish this place? This has been a long one. I heard about your skills from Fossey the High Priest. I have faith that you'll be able to defeat the imposter. A riot broke out in the Colosseum and monsters and humans are fighting everywhere. We're here to catch any monsters that try to run away from the action. Wow, apparently humans who train in the tournaments really can become awfully powerful. I don't care about that. Why can't we leave if we win the tournament? Sure, we'll let you out of here after you become corpses. Uh-oh. Hee hee hee, not a single bone left. I guess I went too far this time. Hee hee, you're brave to come here, but we've already collected enough power to strengthen our lord. Thanks to all those humans who trained themselves to win the tournament, we were able to collect power faster than we'd expected. We don't need your pathetic power anymore. Don't get me wrong, though. That doesn't mean we'll have to l we'll let you leave the temple alive. You puny humans are useless to us now. Die! Die! Look at the belly on this guy. Antoria. Okay. See some of these cool. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, ouchie wouchie, let's heal up. Okay, fight, cast, heal on Pan. Hmm. 
Ooh, good job, Fossey. Fight, cast, heal, on Gabo. Rude, but okay. It's okay, he's gone now. See you later, Antoria. The monster's plan to strengthen the demon lord through stealing others' innate powers and abilities has been thwarted by Pan. The freed priests then defeated the monsters that had taken over the temple, and Dharma was at last able to recover its former vitality. And then, a few days later... No, no, no! I'm not going back to my country unless I become a lovely, beautiful bunny girl! I beg you to stop giving me a hard time. Now that the monsters have been chased off, we're finally back to the old peaceful Dharma. The greatest thing is that people can finally change their vocations. Well then... Okay, no, we're good. We say we slept. Thanks. Don't you have any regrets? You worked hard to get here in your own way. No, I'm not going to do it. I know better than anyone that a one-time thief like myself just isn't out for temple service. I'm sorry to do this to you after all the trouble I've been, but I'm not going to join the guards. I see. I'll miss you. Don't give me that. You're really just grateful to be finally rid of me. So you found me out. I'll be going now. Give my regards to Pen and his comrades. So long, Kasim. My best to you, the brat and the beauty. I guess Neris and Zaji will eventually be taking off too, just like Flower did. Do you suppose Neris would stay with me if I asked her to? Even if she agreed, though, there's no telling what would happen if Zaji opposed it. <coughs> Excuse me. Not too many days have gone by, but already the temple is starting to fill with life and vitality. At this rate, it looks like we're going to be busy soon. Somehow, I managed to visit my old friend's workplace. We're going to be careful while we work so that the temple will never be overrun by monsters again. There was no special books. There is something stuck between two books. Oh my, it's a portrait of High Priest Fossey. I've been searching for a shortcut to becoming a hero by changing classes, but I don't expect to be discovering the technique for a long time. There was no special books. <laughs> oh my. No special books. Pan opened the diary of a priest and started reading it. At last, we have yielded to the monster's incursions. It is now only a matter of time before the Temple of Dharma falls to them altogether. But even if the temple itself falls, we must defend the high priest, even at the cost of our lives. I heard that they would hire a lot of soldiers to strengthen the guard for the temple. Do they feel unsafe having only a few guards after the monster incident? I think so, yes. Okay, great, good, awesome, fantastic. Oh, it's you people. You're just in time. I've changed classes and become a great warrior. What do you think? Don't I look stronger and tougher than before? I bet Neris will see me in a new light for sure now. Well, I'll see you around. Welcome the monsters in to die for the high priest. Makes sense. I think that's the translation problem there, honestly. Okay, great. Hey, the people who were fooled by the fake chief priest are still alive, aren't they? That's what I thought. The most reliable proof is the people returning from the town. I hope my man will return safely and soon, too. I had no idea. I couldn't imagine Dharma Temple was occupied by monsters. I guess... Alright, I talked to this guy already. 
Hey, Komodo. Okay, this is an item shop. What do you got for me? Okay, nothing really. This is the bank, right? I think. Okay, I think that's everything here. So down we go. This is Dharma Temple. People visit us in search of classes that match their personalities. Humans can have unlimited potentials through various experiences and training. Perhaps one day, one who undertakes this training will rise to be a hero. That must be why the Demon Lord sealed this continent away. Oh, it's time, Pear Bear. Welcome to Dharma Temple. Without your help, we wouldn't have been able to restore Dharma Temple. We shall immediately strengthen the temple's defenses to prevent another monster takeover. It only happened because of my weakness. I'll work hard to make sure that it will never happen again. Thank you. I will now take my leave. This is Dharma, where travelers come to find their calling in life. Do you wish to change classes? Yes, please. What a bold decision to wait until you're 30 plus hours in a game to unlock the class system, right? Okay, Pan is going to get his class changed first. And we will make him a Mariner. So it's as close about... It's pretty much what he's got right now. So Pan, you wish to become a Mariner? Hold the image of the Mariner in your heart and pray. Oh God, let Pan walk a new path in life. Now Pen will walk the path of a mariner. Set off for your training, for you have been reborn. Um, yes. Uh, we will now make Maribel a dancer, I believe. Pando's joining the Seattle Mariners? LOL, absolutely, yep. <laughs> yes. Wolf Boy. Wolf Boy should become a thief, I think? Or a fighter. Yeah, a fighter would be kind of fun. I'm going to give him a fighter role. And I believe it can change classes willy-nilly, so... That's fun. <laughs> if you belong to a class, you'll begin to learn the skills and abilities that go along with it. Once you learn a skill or a spell, you never forget it, so it's to your advantage to switch classes. Would you be willing to listen to an explanation of the class system? Not now. Thanks. What do you think, Neris? I'm a great warrior now. I look pretty cool too, don't I? It may be dangerous, but I'll get paid well and then I can afford to get your illness cured. Oh no, Sachi, that's such a dangerous class. What if you get hurt? I wouldn't do anything that stupid. I don't know what you think of me, but I think I could be someone you can really rely on. I'm far better than Kasim. Just let me take care of you. I'd do anything for you. Sachi, you have to stop this. Why do you always go too far trying to take care of me? I don't want anybody making sacrifices for me, not even my little brother. What do you mean sacrifices? I like doing all kinds of things to help you. But it hurts me to see that. It's like I'm a big burden on you and I hate it. I can get along without you, Saji. Okay, I get it. So I'm just a pain to you, am I? Where are you going? I'm just gonna buy a sword. 
I am a great warrior, you know. All great warriors have a sword at their side. I'm sorry, but I'm too upset to talk to anyone right now. Do you know that the monsters were planning to do with all the powers they stole from the humans? Yes. What? You already know? I'm impressed. You must really know a lot. I do. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about a thing. Even if you change your class, you'll still keep all of your experiences and abilities. So as long as you're journeying, there's no reason not to have a class. Did you know the High Priest of Dharma is a little girl? You think she can handle it? What if she changes you to the wrong class? I can tell you're an expert. Why don't you show me what you've got? Oh, I see. Well, so long. All right, then. Seeing is believing. If you fight just 14 times more, Pan, you can rise to the skill level of Mariner. If you fight just five more times more, Maribel. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Perfect. Thanks for the Hydra, Captain Giraffe. Ding. Thanks, ma'am. Ooh, I didn't realize I could just use a thief's key to unlock some of those. The only thing we can be thankful for is that the monsters who took Dharma did ruin the interior. I don't know what we would have done if they'd put up a relief of some horrible monster or something. This temple is nice and large. Nothing like my cramped little place. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess we're... Done here, I think? Oh. You're going to leave Neris? If I stay any longer, it will only cause her to suffer. Therefore, it is best that I leave here. Then I'm going to step in and be there for her. Is that what you want? That is between you and her. It has nothing to do with me. Well, if that's the way you feel, then take care and keep safe. Thank you, and give her my regards, too. Should I talk to this guy? Is he still around here? I suppose you'll be leaving here soon? I suppose that's obvious. You only came here to change classes after all. Now how in the world am I going to tell Neris that Zaji's gone? Knowing him, he probably hasn't said a thing to her. By the way, Elden Ring on Fridays aside, do you have a date when the quarry starts? Um, we'll start all of our uh, scary games in October and we'll put everything... Pretty much everything on pause, like Dragon Warrior and all that, uh, then, so. All right, I forgot to talk to Neris one last time. I'm sorry that you all had to see that. Don't worry, Sachi and I weren't really arguing. I wonder what's taking him so long, though. It shouldn't take this long to buy a sword. He's gone, lady. Can I open this stuff now? Heck yeah. October, eh? Yeah, I'm going to be washing my hair that month, the entire month. <laughs> of course. <laughs> ah, no one is around to collect rent anymore. I'm going to save up and buy another pair of underwear. It's real nice. Soon this town will disappear from the planet, the soul sword, soul shattering, and the rest will be forgotten. I'm trying to find people to escape here with, but no one wants to be with a useless bard like me. Uh, business is so, so, is so slow, maybe it's time to move on. Ha! Now I can prove to everyone that I'm a priest of Dharma. Too bad it doesn't matter now. That priest is really racking up a tab. What am I supposed to do? Build Dharma Temple? Let me 
of looks like that's it for here. Let's save the game one more time since we're here. The priest vowed to remain in this town forever, but virtually no one comes here anymore. Um, yes, I would like to continue playing, please. Just a little bit longer. Thank you. Just gonna finish exploring all these towns here, seeing what people are up to. Ooh, I can buy more of these. I heard that some travelers killed the false Dharma priest. I'm not getting half the customers I used to. It's probably time to close up shop. I think it is, sir, yes. Damn, I'm hungry. We could be eating right now if all the maids and servants hadn't quit. Anything back here? Nope. Oh, around this way. I opened that chest, right? Yep. I like this town. I finally found a place where I could be in control. But it's all over now. I'm just gonna fade away with the rest. The town may be free, but there's still monsters outside. It makes walking to the temple a perilous feat. Two siblings named Neris and Zaji used to live here. I wonder where they are now. Gonzo. I hear that there is a way to regain strength that has been taken from you, but it sounds like a hassle. I think I'll just stay here and be lazy a while longer. I feel you, buddy. <laughs> Can I not go in here? I'm like, what the heck is going on? Now that the monsters are gone, no one can go soul shattering. Nighttime isn't so terrifying anymore. Have you heard? Dharma Temple has been saved from the monsters. Of course, that means this town is not long for the world. Thank goodness, it's not a great place. Okay. I think that's everything here, but we got our land shard, so that was important. Right. We, there was the people in... Oh, this is not the well where people were in. Well, whatever. Gonna just doubly check. For one little spot. Down hither. Oh, can I go into this room now? Should this place be invaded by monsters again, even I must wield a sword in its defense. Ow, 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 ow. Perfect. 
perfect. Okay, we can survive this. Do 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 do. Ouchie, ouchie. And I think there's another one over here that we hadn't been able to get last time either. Cassie was promoted to commander of the Interior Guard after saving the High Priest. <sighs> so now I'll be working under the command of a young kiddo. Okay, uh, cast, heal mores. Woohoo! A land shard. Yeah, we're missing those for sure. Ouchie, ouchie, woo. Okay, I don't think that there was... How's the arena after all of this? There's just no one around here, right? It's just dead? Dead as doornails? Probably. You never know what you're missing around here. It's apparently nothing. We're missing nothing. So good to know. <laughs> Okay, well, we can move on. Let's get the heck out of here. There's also that second town where the, like, kind of off on the mountainside, but I think I have to walk through the temple, which is kind of annoying to get there. So, or not necessarily the temple, through, like, the caves. Might be quicker to go through the other town, but... I think we'll go over to the place where the casino is, and I think there's save stuff there. So we'll go down there and save the game. Captain Giraffe, question for chat. IDK anything about the Soulsborne games, Elden Ring, other than it's very unforgiving. Do you save manually or is it autosave? I think almost all modern games are autosavey, but. No idea. This is Jake. Interesting. Interesting reaction, but what does it mean? This is the last sanctuary, blah, 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 blah. Okay, well, I thought maybe you would have something more for me there, but... Oh, okay. Boring. 
but they say the same stuff, so whatever. We will use this in. And then we will save. Alrighty, room. Okay, let's see here. Uh, no, it is time for rest. Thank you for playing. Thanks for playing. Well, everyone, thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. Turn off the system. Yes, please. I had a lot of fun. Let me just flip over the, the HDMI here. Had a great time playing video games with you all tonight. Watching, uh, watching the old uh, Dragon Warrior Seven or playing the old Dragon Warrior Seven. Took a long time, but we unlocked the class stuff, which is really fun on a bun, right? Um, and Gelada could do both auto and manual saves. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, tonight we're going to uh, raid Super Nimbau. Our old buddy, old pal. So let's, uh, he's playing through Mega Man uh, Zero Three. Um, and as you all know, I will not be streaming tomorrow because I do not stream on Thursdays. Um, but I'll be back on uh, Friday with our grand premiere of Elden Ring or Panden Ring as we're calling it. So stay tuned for that. I'm sure it's going to be totally uh banana since I've never played a game like that before um especially on stream uh and Gelada says before you begin look carefully at the classes to help you decide how you want to play I mean that's what you do in any sorts of games like that right um I will try to yeah so yeah we'll definitely be be getting ourselves right into it so have a great night everyone rest well be safe and I'll see you all um tomorrow. Okay. I mean, Friday, 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 Friday. Bye.